welcome to the fresh catch of the day, Ready Steady Cool. And now, here's your host, Peter Everett. Welcome to Ready, Steady, Cook, where two of Australia's talented chefs and two studio contestants have just 20 minutes to make four dishes using a pantry full of items and, of course, the bag of surprise goodies. Now, it's time to meet our uh, chefs today. Now, who is going to be putting a spring into the, our steps today? Let's meet them. In the red corner, please welcome executive chef from Red Latin Restaurant in Sydney, Mark Jensen. And welcome our award-winning chef from... The catering company, Rolling oh, Del Mares in Noosa, Matty Golinski. Now, what is your secret food indulgence? Do you have one? Yeah, I think I do. I was thinking about it. You know, I love to have lots of fresh, healthy foods in my shopping trolley, but sometimes I'm pushing it along and then I look down and there's like packets and packets of potato chips. Who puts that there? Well, I think I contribute. You know, oh, you like a just, potato chip? What's I like your favourite flavour? Well, there's a soy and lemon. And lime. And lime. Is that the one? I love that, I love that one too, yeah. What nice. about you? Are you a potato chip oh, I boy? Do like, How do you I still do like so thin and have potato chips? Anyway. Um, stress. <laughs> okay. Just oh, the wonderful. chef thing. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I do like my potato chips, but I've got a bit of a, a um, tropical fruit fetish at this time of year. Lychees and mangoes. Tropical I can just fruit? Eat kilos of lychees. Really? Yeah. I love a good lychee. Yeah, that's Yum. Healthy. That's the Queensland thing. It's do they grow them in Queensland yes, lychees? Yes, they do. There you are. Yep. Why well, don't you bring some down? I will next time. Next I'm time, sorry. Maddie. <laughs> now, cooking uh, with us just today, cooking with Mark, firstly, for the tomato team, please give a big happy cheer. For our first contestant, she's studying early childhood uh, studies at university, and now she has a party trick that's going to make all of us laugh out <laughs> really loud. So a big hi to Megan from Sydney. <laughs> Hello, party trick girl. Hello. Hello, you. Hello. You. Welcome, welcome. Hello. You. A party trick. Yes. You got your party dress on. Yes. So you're going to do your party trick. Yes, it's a kookaburra noise. Do a kookaburra. Um. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> it's like it's, there's a battery somewhere. Can you do one more? There's another little. And anything else? Uh, what? What? You, no, tell me. What was it? A what? What can you do? A dolphin. All right, do it. Do you it's do action? Like Great. You get a lot of boyfriends like that. No. I know. Oh, well, you will now. Some real wackos. No, no, no. no, no, no sorry. No, sorry. You can have an old menagerie like sort of old McDonald's farm, though. Oh, uh, now, what have we got here? They've got the classic bag, $20. Yeah. We've got... I love that. <laughs> Think of some more animals later. Anyway, okay. go. We've got some porterhouse steak. Ooh. Ice can you do a bull or a cow? Mm. <laughs> There we go. Right. I'm going to be known as the animal lady. That's it. You'll be channeling. Um, so we've got oh, that. The, the iceberg lettuce. The old iceberg, uh -huh. the common favourite. Yes, I like that one. Yep. The Fuji apples. Fuji. The chat potatoes. Yes. Mm -hmm. And button mushrooms. Oh, nice. There's a few old bulls in the audience today, are there? Mmm. <laughs> I like the food. Now, you've brought someone special as well. Yep. That's what normally happens. Yes. Who have we got today? Uh, my good friend, Adrian. Adrian, so please welcome Megan's best mate, who loves travelling. He loves travelling, has just returned from living in Spain. A lucky boy. Big hello to Adrian from Sydney. Hello. Hi. How are you? What Spanish and what Spanish for welcome? Hola. Ben oh. Bienvenido. 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 Welcome. Hola. Yeah. Hola. Hola. G'day. Hello. G'day, mate. Oh, listen to you. You old. G'day. G'day, mate. So, okay. what's it been like travelling in Spain and all that? Wonderful. It's okay. What's your, is your heritage? What's that? Um, Spanish Hungarian. Mother Spanish. Ah, oh, so, um, so there's the influence there. Yeah, okay. and lots of family and all that right. sort of thing. And how do you and Megan know each other? We met through a mutual friend at a pub one day. <gasps> yeah. Oh, over, did so? she do that? <laughs> <laughs> Thankfully not. I would have kept away then if she oh. did. Oh, oh no. 
<laughs> I love that. <laughs> yeah. Now, what have you got here for us? $20 All classic right. bag. Okay, I've got Silver Beat. Yeah. Um, Rissoni. Oh, I love oh, that. I good. think it's like a pasta. Um, I've got Chicken Breast. Yeah. Yes. Skinless. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I've got Corn. Corn. On, on the cob. And love bums. Oh, lovely. Oh, lovely. Yeah. We happy nice. with that, Mark? Yeah, very happy with that. Thank Good. you. All right, so now you've got 20 minutes, I think, the way the... Is that all? 20 minutes, <laughs> four dishes. Now, and Matt will teach you many, many wonderful new recipes. Maybe a little bit of Spanish influence today. Yeah, let's do Maybe. that. Maybe. Sounds good. <laughs> oh, what are you all excited over here? What's going to... Yeah, what are we going to do? We've been discussing our ideas, yeah. and we thought we'd, what we'd do will be... Whereas we've we'll got our iceberg lettuce, so we'll just do a wedge of the iceberg lettuce mm -hmm. and we'll make a really nice um, yogurt dressing to go with that. Lovely. Simple but delicious. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, mushrooms. <laughs> we want to know what to do with mushrooms, so we're going to do a, a mushroom kind of like pate or paste. Oh. And mm. we'll put that on half of our, our steak and roast that through the oven. Yum. And serve that with some smashed potatoes. You get to eat all this too, remember that. <laughs> <laughs> the other half of the steak. Uh, We'll just do it simple, maybe some garlic and parsley. Yep. But make a warm potato and mushroom salad. Terrific. Mm -hmm. And for dessert. Dessert. We dessert. love dessert. Well, no. we know we love dessert. We'll do we'll use these apples and we'll make like a rustic apple tart, I think. Oh. Rustic wow. apple tart. <laughs> yum. Yum, yum. All right, kids, what are we gonna do? Well, what are we gonna do? We're I going don't to know. <laughs> got any ideas? No. Oh, I wouldn't have a clue. Um, we're going to do a um, a chicken and corn soup with the um, risoni in the bottom, so it's very kind of nice like a hearty yep. soup, very yep. nice. Good. Good combination, the chicken and the corn. Um, we'll do a chicken with chilli and plum sauce using fresh blood plums. Thought uh -huh. that'd be nice. Um, <laughs> yeah. Okay. And uh, we'll stuff some of these silver beet leaves, we'll blanch them and, and roll them, filled with some of the, the fried, we'll sweat some corn off with some uh -huh. onions and garlic, Great. Some, red, some green peppers, that sort of thing. And then we'll do. We're going to paprika, smoke paprika crust one of these chicken breasts and roast it, and serve mm. that with the silver beet rolls. Yum. And last, lastly, the is this dessert? For dessert. Do you like a dessert? I do love a dessert. We mm. love dessert. Lots of dessert. We're going to do a um, a red wine poached blood plums. Yep. Um, in kind of a sugary red wine, yep. and then we're going to make that into a like a tart. Bake it in the oven with almond meal or with something. With almond meal as a base. <gasps> I just nice. gave you that recipe then, you see. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> it sounds absolutely delicious, there's no doubt. Now, we need to get the show on the road, everyone. But firstly, what we have to say here in the studio audience and everyone at home, ready, steady, cock start cooking! Let's just recap what our chefs are going to cook. Firstly, Megan and Mark for the uh, tomato team, we've got the iceberg wedge with the yogurt dressing. The grilled porterhouse steak with mushroom crust and potato smash. And the garlic steak with the warm potato, mushroom and iceberg salad. And a rustic apple tart to finish. Yum. And just to recap here what Maddie and Adrian are going to be cooking for us for the capsicum team. We have the chicken, the corn and the rossoni soup. The paprika roasted chicken with rossoni and corn stuffed silver beet the chicken stir fry with chilli and plum sauce and to finish the blood plum and red wine tart with the frang a frangipan sort of thing? Oh, not really yeah. frangipan, not really more, frangipan, more of a, like an almondy biscuity crust, almost right. like a cheesecake without the cheese, if you like. What do you think of that? So clear. Yeah. So clear. It's very we'll soon find out. Cheesecake without the cheese. It's very, like. very modern. Very modern. Yeah. And less fattening. Less I would fattening, have exactly. Now, what about you? What was home life like? Does mum cook? Does dad cook? Dad. There's exotic uh, heritage here at the parents. Dad doesn't know where the kitchen is. Hello, dad. Um, yeah. Learn <laughs> where the kitchen is. Um, mum lives in the kitchen, so she, she's she, always cooking. She yeah. does. And your mum is Spanish. Spanish. Yes. So lots of what? Paella? Paella, yep. Pa um, oh, paella. 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 Yeah. Yep. Um, get it right. Get it right. Um, no. Um, yeah, churros, which is like which a is, what's that? It's like a breakfast. Yeah. Um, with like a it's like a donut consistency, but long. And, and, and we dip them in sweet. sugar. And yeah. sugar and cinnamon. We thing. roll it in sugar. Yeah. Cinnamon. Yeah. And you dip it in hot chocolate. Oh, yum! Yeah. That's so, so good. Terrific. Well, Mark and Matt are putting a brand new shine on some old favourites here, folks. So stick around and see what the boys are up to. After this break, we'll see you back here real soon. I'm ready to study